Hey, my peeps, let's make some bee-themed cookies with this silicone mold. This is one of my favorite molds. You can make tons of cookies, but that cookie mold is like a weird-shaped cookie, so I usually use a cookie cutter to round it out. But I have a mixture of sprinkles. It has tiny little bees in it. It has all kinds of stuff in there. And then I took a honeycomb that I made with the honey glue, with the honey yellow glue. And I'm just cutting it up to pieces because I'm going to add that to my cookie too. So basically, I'm taking the little bees. See the little tiny bees? They, you can't see them that good. but And I'm placing them all around the cookie. Here and there, you know, wherever I could put it in and then I'm taking the little bits of the honeycomb because I also want that to show in my cookie and then I'm just going to take some of the sprinkle mix that I made and just fill in the rest of the cookie so I have little sunflowers in there I have honeycomb in there I have black beads I have sprinkles and yellow black and white I have little gold specks. It's a, just a big old mixture of stuff. So now I'm going to get me some yellow clay. And I'm just going to press that into the mold. And uh, you want to make sure you press it. You want to get a good impression. But you also want to make sure you put it in there gently. So that you won't um, cover up all the sprinkles. If you kind of mush it in there. The sprinkles will get hidden in the clay and you won't see them. So you got to be careful when you put your clay down. And then I'm just rolling out so I can get all the excess clay up. Because we don't need to be wasting clay that we don't need to waste. And just make sure that the edges um, look good. Roll it flat so we have a nice back. And then just pop it out. If you have trouble popping out your cookie... Mm -hmm. Just use a little bit of baby oil before you put in your clay. You should be good. So you see that cookie? I don't like the way that cookie is shaped. So I always use a cookie cutter to round it out. Because I want my cookies to be round. I mean, there's nothing wrong with it being the way it is. But it's just my preference. It's for them to be round. So there you go. You see it got honeycombs in it. got the tiny little bees and all the other sprinkle mix that i have and there you go there go your bee themed cookies so go make you some talk to you later bye